some resistance to U.S. military presence here, such as peaceful demonstrations that take place here Monday in Munich, every Monday, and yearly demonstrations against the security conference in Munich, and more recently, uh, demonstrations are developing in Ramstein, uh, in front of the drone base. However, these grassroots actions are immediately associated to uh, the nationalism of the 30s, that we are uniting as a nation and standing up by the mainstream press immediately. So, you've described this sort of action by the mainstream media as the fifth filter. Could you briefly touch, touch upon that again and why the mainstream media uses this sort of um, uh, action to quell grassroots uh, movements? The mainstream media are an ideological instrument. Uh, they, have, uh, they have owners, they have commitments, they have uh, uh, advertising support and so on. They, they're very valuable. I mean, I read them all the time. I'm glad they're there. But we shouldn't have any illusions. They're not coming from Mars. They are based on existing institutions of, of power uh, and domination within our societies. And that affects uh, the way what they choose to discuss at all, some things they don't discuss, and the ways in which they do it. It would be almost a miracle if that weren't true. And when they condemn actions like these, that should be taken as praise say we're doing the right thing. If these institutions condemn us, that's pretty good reason to think we're doing the right thing. It happens to be counter to their particular interests, but they don't represent the public interest. They represent certain special interests of power and domination and privilege. So if they don't like what we're doing, fine, let's continue. And it is the right thing to do, at least if you care about the survival of the species. And that's what's at stake. We should recognize that in the case of nuclear weapons, as well as environmental catastrophe, we're really talking about survival of the species. In the case of nuclear weapons, literal survival. And it, as again, I repeat, it's come very close in the past, and there's no reason to think that's not going to repeat.